And we're back. Oh my god. Here we are. I've been it's going happening again. Years. It's funny, because you'd be like, oh, was the last chapter like Kenobi? And it's like, no, it was Andor. That was the last of Star Wars. Oh, right? yeah, that it was, was nice. Kenobi, uh, the the chapter. final chapter. I'm pretty I'm... sure the discussion on Andor ended with us saying like, oh boy, it would suck if like it goes back to the, you know, the dark times. But there's no reason to assume otherwise. What was... The format, the formula of the, that, of course, uh, Boba and Kenobi like drove hardcore into the ground. But the format we talk about with Disney TV shows was it? It was two, but two to three two fight scenes, scenes, right? Place. It's like two to yeah. three is the, is the golden. Right. You have uh, one maybe in the first act, and then a little bit of downtime, and then a big third act like action scene. Usually one more cameos. Uh, Mando was definitely Mando season oh. two, so. We're getting at least one cameo, possibly two, I would say, in episode one, and then we'll probably have one throughout. Oh, I've yeah. already heard that Boba Fett will be in this season. Thank God. He is oh, thank so goodness. cool. We really need that his incredible exciting. insight and his very cool... Oh, yes. ...ness. Whatever he does, to... it's cool. We need it. Be yes. Exciting. I'm, I'm Boba so Fett excited. Will compliment Can't Mando's wait. story very well. Can't Don't wait forget to see the new rockets again. Inane, pointless quests, and we've already been set with one. He has to go to Mandalore that might not be okay or whatever to do. He has to go to a yeah, bar or something. Yeah, something lake. about the Mandalorian home planet, because I really care about the Mandalorian and their home planet, where everyone's just fucking like miserable or whatever. They all I can only assume like that everyone's and miserable. Quietly and there's and yeah. Full, like full stops are after every word. They diluted the hell out of like the Mandalorian, like as a of cool thing from star wars oh yeah they stink and then of course yeah it's People just like, like yeah mandalorians i love how it's barely yeah. even a subject but i was like you know well this is the third season looking <laughs> after one character and how is he doing well he's um... he's gotten all the like the gadgets from across star wars and he's met all the cool people and he even spoke to Luke Skywalker, took down the, the equivalent of Darth Vader in this storyline, and rescued all of the people, and he met all of the people, and he's bros with fucking Boba Fett. But he's like the, he's just like Rey, kind of. It's the same goal in, in the sequel trilogy. They just want you to feel the wonders of Star Wars through the character, and then they completely forget to characterize the character. Or that they deliberately make them very bland so that they can just fit into everything. There's no real stress there. Yeah, but remember? he's he's got a Naboo fighter, and that's really cool and very that, practical for from the quests. prequels. That, so that's cool. Remember, he used to hate droids. We that was a thing once upon a time. I, I can't yeah, believe that. that. Yeah, yeah that you're for right. Like a couple of episodes. Yeah. One of his most inconsistent character traits is now just gone. So that's better, I guess. <laughs> Much better, I guess. Hooray. But they haven't given us any other yeah. ones except maybe that he he misses he likes Grogu. Well, he oh, should be yeah. the leader. He should that's leader. the big thing. What if there's someone out there who went from season one coverage, season two coverage, season three, and they're like, wow, this will be a great season because he's not even going to have Grogu this time. Well, have I got news for you. <laughs> what? There's been what? two bonus Mandalorian episodes, specials that came out in a different show. Man, That's did they true. fill in some gaps. Looks Ooh, like boy. we got us uh, Mandalorian is teamed back up with baby Grogu because they realized, holy fuck, we can't separate them. That would be insane. People love the yeah. cute baby. They're so they're such incredibly good characters, and they have such chemistry. I mean, one of them has no personality, and the other one's an actual infant, and they can't speak. Sometimes I think they are just trying to pad out the time code in terms of like, all right, it's, you know, Mandalore is walking into new places. He meets Cameo. He's got the baby doing cute things. He does some shooting with his gun or his ship. It's, oh look, a monster! Ah, every two episodes or something, and then and then it's like, we get the end C credits? Yes, okay, we made it another one, all right. Well, it's just an actual well, one, like, is there actually a writer's room, or is it just like a computer that just says, <laughs> look, you should, I've calculated it, you need to have this happen at this time code, and this happen at this time code, and it's like you said, it's the same recurring element, because yes, there will almost certainly be a scene that's just him walking into town with Grogu doing some cute stuff along the way, is and then there? they meet the character who they're going to hang out with, you know, for that episode, and then they leave, and then Grogu will do something cute on the ship, and Mando will look on like, yeah, that's my boy, and then they'll go <laughs> off on their next adventure. Is it's there a story? Padding. That's the question. Has oh, there even that's been a, real a question, story? Especially uh, when, yeah. um, season three, if Mandalore and that whole plot's meant to be a big thrust, you would think that this season, more than the other seasons, would be the one to go proper serialization, where, like, each episode feeds directly into the next one, and developing an overarching story. I don't think it will. No, no, me neither. We should probably discuss very quickly uh, John Favreau and his declining levels of respect from a lot of people oh. thanks to these projects. Yeah, 
Uh, um, it seems like he is the guy for hire who will come along and, and do like the project and it will probably make a lot of money. Yeah. But as for having any sort of enduring legacy or, or just being like a great piece of art, I don't know. It seems like he doesn't care that much anymore about like storytelling. Is he doing the next Lion King live adaptation thing, thing, Flynn? Uh, the sequel, I think. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, that's. I can't imagine they'll put more effort into the sequel than the previous ones. It's probably worse. Remember when he when he directed Iron Man? That was that was good times. Down, down, and that was a nightmare production that they pieced together through hard work and passion. And... Oh well. Yeah, but that's no. We don't want that anymore. We want key jangling. That's what we want. Well, this is Filoni Favreau work. So, uh, Whoa. I have to get excited. <laughs> no, this well, is that's the thing. why we've had over two seasons <sighs> of Din Djarin, yep. and you know, like, nothing about him. Yep. There's really nothing to know about him, it seems. Except he, he talks pretty, like this. Yeah, um, kind of like a personality vacuum. Constipated which is a shame. and full yeah. stops I, everywhere. I, I, I still remember when I was, like, hyped for the idea of a story that was not directly connected to, like, the main saga about a bounty hunter in this galaxy. It's like a story that I wanted to see for a long time. And it's so lame that it isn't what I thought it was going to be. Yeah, because we're going to get fucking cameos again, and we're just going to go to famous yeah. places, see famous people. And apparently and there's no cap on this. They may just keep it going forever, as the latest uh, It'll just keep going well, until right. it stops generating money, it's like, and that's when they decide that it ends. It's like merchandise. It's not an actual story. Oh, it's yeah, it's absolutely. It's on the shelves until it stops selling. It's always yeah. been that. People who are just now realizing it, are, I mean, I'm glad you eventually caught up, but I mean, <laughs> this has always just been, it's been fast food. Well, it's empty calories. Um, like, uh, well, I say that about every show like this. It drives me nuts. <laughs> it's just, I feel like I'm, I'm watching something and I gain nothing is kind of what I'm getting at. There was a, there was a thread talking about like the comments from him that got misunderstood, I guess, by about the two year gap or whatever. There's some people saying like, oh God, like kind of makes sense like the, you know the mandalorian shows aren't exactly known for making much sense at all but someone else <laughs> said like what do you mean they're bangers like especially compared to like boba fett or whatever and then i saw another comment saying it's it's got nothing on kenobi but <laughs> 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 which i can read in a different way mm. but uh like there was a huge drop off in quality between seasons one and two i'm just sitting there like man people will tell themselves anything like the stories that, that are getting spun to like justify why you'll look back and be like, did I even like that? What was even in that? And you'll just like, can I remember anything? anything. It's like, oh, yeah, it can fell I remember off. A That's scene? what it is. It fell off. It's like season one and two are pretty close in terms of quality. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, they're both really bad. I don't know which one's worse. I think this. Um, it's really tough to say. Yeah, because season one's surprising when you start to dig in. What well, is interesting that somebody would look at season one and two and like note marked differences between them when they follow the exact same story structure and suffer <laughs> yeah. from a lot of the same problems. I mean, yeah, I think season two was more problem. obviously bad. More cameos. But maybe that's just me. They had more cameos, yeah. Because I think people well, liked in season one, the... it felt more removed with uh, mysteries oh, yeah, and clues exactly. to things, but season two was like, Boba Fett, Bo-Katan, Look at Mad Dog. all those. Like, yeah, dark all those mysteries saber. and clues led nowhere. I just like, can't believe they just put film. two Mando episodes in there. That was so weird. <laughs> Boba Fett, I think yeah. I'll, I think I'll never get over that. It's just like, oh, yo, that happened. It's like, where's uh, Boba Fett? Oh, he's not in this episode at all. It's like, that okay. Shit. And the the production value was clearly to the point where it's like it they probably so started different. filming season three. Something got in the way and it got canned after two episodes or some shit. Yeah. I can't imagine what happened behind the scenes to make it so that two episodes that seemed to be built by two like different groups of people ended up in a different TV show. Like, what the fuck <laughs> is that? It's a little I can bit only assume that it was yeah meta reasons. We oh yeah, to get something happened. Put out yeah. But we finally got us Mandalorian season three. Episode oh my god. One. Are you guys ready for this roller coaster? I'm ready to know. delve back into the world of Star Wars. The last Star Wars content we watched was Andor, and this will be like the opposite of Andor. Andor yeah. had a story. This will be the, this will be the <laughs> anti Andor. Andor had a story and characters. Yep. And like themes. Yep. This will have uh, none of them. Well, <laughs> it, it's, it will it's only have a story in the descriptive sense. Like, yeah, I guess time, that's whatever happened. The opening, like, shot or the opening actions the character takes should be representative of, like, the overall arcing thing that's going to be happening in the season. Give you little clues. Garen fucking T, we don't get that with Mando because they have no idea what's happening. It'll probably be something cool. That's, that's going to be the. Ooh. 
the sort of rule of thumb for them, I think. Just show us cool stuff. I'm still not really in the mindset of, oh, there's a new season of Mando, even though we're about to watch it. <laughs> I was like, Nobody even seems it? to care about this one, but we'll see. Well, it's I been a few even... years since season two. It's, it's been a while, right? So you think that people would be like just really giddy for new Mando stories. Well, my, 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 my mom was excited. Well, she was, she's excited for Grogu. <laughs> that's, that's, I mean, I think. it's safe to say <laughs> that Boba yeah, Fett but... and Kenobi really did uh, dampen people's sort of... This was safer. Mando was just safer. Kenobi and Boba Fett, uh, there was higher expectations and it was like of lower quality. So it's like back to the safety. This is just like the standard burger from McDonald's now. Manufacturer's protocol. Oh yeah, that makes oh, sense. We should probably get a previously on. I hope they involve scenes that aren't even in this fucking show, <laughs> <laughs> because otherwise people are gonna know what's going on. Wait, sorry, why are they showing us this? I'll cover your face. You are not Mandalorian. I guess we're seeing Bo-Katan. Oh, is she like all over this? I think I heard that she's like all over this. I wouldn't have thought we'd see her in episode one, but I guess maybe we are. Have you ever removed your helmet? I have. You have forsaken Mad Lawrence by taking your helmet off, loser. It's yeah. weird. We have a strange, like, crossover where the last thing we watched from Star Wars was Andor, which had, like, plot and good characters and great scenes and stuff. And we're also watching The Last of Us, where mm. you have Pedro yeah. Pascal acting really well. Now we have this, which is, like, the combined <laughs> worst elements of both, yep. where we just don't get to have him acting and we don't get to have characters or, like, a plot or anything. Well, yeah, and he stopped being in the suit, I think, even in season two. So it's just he does voice lines every once in a while now. Oh. I hope he's just like, oh, if you guys don't care, I don't care either. I, he just, can be I like, I'm gonna to imagine. Just... <laughs> you don't drop this role because of the money and the prestige, yeah. but man, like, what a shitty I'm role. I'm gonna go over here and act in this other show. <laughs> it feels that way. Which is funny, Wait, right? I'm... Because if everything goes the way we expect, he might already have, like, fucking two episodes of The Last of Us left to film now. Oh my right. goodness, it's the cool blacksmith. She's so cool and yeah. awesome. She this hits the yeah, right. troopers with Mando her hammer. To this totally looks like himself. a blacksmith sort of, like, area, doesn't it? It doesn't look like a set at all with everything being super mm. clean and shiny. Oh, this is absolute. This is so, this is so fucking fake. <laughs> lame. <laughs> lame, lame, lame. Do you remember Jabba's Palace, that whole fucking every At least room. it's not so nasty. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's the thing. I don't need slime everywhere, okay? But it'd be nice if we hot could cream. have... Some delicious hot cream. Maybe this is a brand new sort of smithing area. You notice that continuity error? It was curved in one of the shots. And then yeah, it was I was about to say. One. Oh, come yeah. on. They're trying. <laughs> wow. Maybe. Not a very steady hand there. Oh, she's making a mask. Ooh. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, yeah, the whole, the whole thing is Mando has to like... Uh, Redeem, re redeem himself, relieve himself of his burden of having taken away his helmet or something, even though he's still leader. He literally would have died if he hadn't done it, and it means yeah. he's no longer a Mandalorian, which is one of the most stupid, like, no homers club type things ever. Oh, it's like a tiny person helmet. It's a little child person. Oh, it's, 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 <laughs> look at all these fucking losers. Is it just me or does that look really... It's like a bunch of people camped out in front of a star oh, to get this tickets. Is a, this is a flashback, isn't it? This I guess is, so. This is Mando getting initiated or something. I swear on my name and the names of the ancestors. I think if I liked this show more, I wouldn't find this as cringe. I find these guys very uh, try-hard at this point in terms of like, oh, aren't, we, super aren't we super cool and mystical and, and like... Well, I guess that's the problem is they used to be cool and mystical, but then this show started <laughs> providing some pretty yeah. unsatisfying answers. Now they're shit and well, remember when, did the, what What's the word? Did they all die in uh, in Navarro? That was, there was a pile of their all armors, right? They at least gave up all their armors. Two. The blacksmith and the one Chungus guy died, everyone except them, right? Oh, well, yeah, because up. the last time we were with them so in, in Boba Fett, wow. it was just her and that guy. The well, I can't water. drink it. You just gave me the helmet. Yeah, this is where they teach you how to drink with it on, because it's <laughs> it's a big deal. Oh, no, they're getting invaded. It's a tsunami. What the fuck? Uh, <laughs> oh, or a big alligator. How did they know it was coming? <laughs> she could sense it, I get. Why is this happening? <laughs> pew, 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 pew. Oh, come on. Why? If you die, you suck. Wow, you, you, suck. you had a jetpack jet and everything. Just go in the cave. Oh my god, Mandalorians are so shit. All of you, back up into the cave, now. How are animals blaster proof There's in this universe? Sudden giant crocodile. Oh my yeah, god, the amount it. of people falling over who have jetpacks. Just start <laughs> flying, you losers. Fly yes, away. Fly. Why? Fly. This thing is clearly landbound. <laughs> I threw her at it. You <laughs> why, why are you? Why? <laughs> Oh come you, on! You, we're like this guy. Oh, we're thinking we should use these. We're like three minutes into the actual start of this. Okay, now some of them have learned how to fly. Let me 
guess that Why won't kill shoot it. Shoot it in the eye. Oh, look at that shot. Wow, that's art. Oh, oh, God. oh you suck, <laughs> loser. You're so shit. Why? Why are you attaching Why? yourself to it? Why are they all attaching themselves they're, to they're it? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Idea. So the blasters can't penetrate it, but those hooks what? can grab into its skin? What is yeah. the point of that? It's just going to pull you. What's doing? Gonna... Oh, that guy's gone too. <laughs> Why are you within head oh range? Oh my god, these guys suck. <laughs> there you go. So yeah, there you go. He's death rolling. He's it's death yeah. rolling. Okay. You guys well, you suck. <laughs> oh, here she comes. She's got, Do something she's cool. Gonna hit it with her gonna use Do something your cool, Hammer Lady. Why the she's fuck are you still it. carrying those, you moron? You need to save his life. Throw them. What are you doing? Are you fucking smithing tools? Why are you? Why are you, why are you hold them with you? Why? What are nah, you doing? Was, oh my god! It was god. gonna hit him with the hammer. Oh, <laughs> why do you suck? Why so are they still shooting it? Go inside. What? They're what, what were you doing over there? Oh, you. Why didn't you, you get you, up on the hill? You and totally everything. didn't need to do that. He's, oh. oh my. Wait, that's Mando. So this isn't Wait, a flashback. Is, uh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sure. So he just happened to be visiting them when the giant crocodilus was killing them, really? Uh... Okay, and what? <sighs> so why did this even oh happen? God. There's really bad CGI guts everywhere. Why did this happen? I don't know. Because we needed an action scene. Is this at a the common of the occurrence episode? in this fucking world? Maybe you should have your oh, ceremonies away from the water. You're sitting at the oh, river again, twice. And they've already done yeah. the noise twice. <laughs> Yeah, of course they have. Oh, fuck no, off. Everyone start saying this is the way. No. This is the way. <laughs> this is the way. <laughs> this is the way. One scene, and we're already- we're back. We're back into he shit yeah. Star Wars. Yeah. He lands, and he's like, Jesus Christ, we've been in space for like a week, and this baby has taken so many shits back <laughs> <Yeah>. there. <laughs> I locked him in his little room. I think he's I dying. I can't believe- I can't believe he hasn't <laughs> choked on the fumes <laughs> in his little bubble. I can't believe I bought this fucking ship. You have removed your helmet. I don't... We've done all of this. We've had this conversation. He's betrayed the Mandalorians. He took the helmet off. He's going to go to Mandalore. The creed teaches us of redemption. Redemption is no longer possible since the destruction of our homeworld. Who uh, makes all these stupid rules? What does okay. that even you mean? You can't Mr. bathe Mr. in the mines of Mandalore if you... You can't... Oh, right. I like so how redemption can't... isn't tied to some it's principle or foundation. It's a literal place that is law. destroyable. It's a literal place. <laughs> You have to go and stupid bathe is that? there. Yeah, and Rags, and what really gets you into this dishonorable place? Yeah. Like taking your helmet off, even temporarily, even to save a life. We this is what I mean about it. It makes them stupid. Off. No, it sucks. Really There's like lame. nothing interesting or cool about them. Is this inscription not Mandalorian? This relic only proves Mandalore's entire surface has been crystallized by fusion rays. Yeah, that proves that the entire surface of a planet has been turned into crystals. Obviously. Like, <laughs> Does it even prove anything? No. <laughs> Why don't you like just really pay some money like, to send it... someone to look with like a satellite? <laughs> just go there. You, you have guys a starship. Have ships. You guys have stars. You have <laughs> this is actually like... not a big deal at all. If this is the new republic, is there any reason why you can't go to Mandalore? Go there. Like, are they? Yeah. Are they did I have a blockade or loved... something to prevent people from going there? We brought hey. this up with uh, with Boba Fett, but the idea that she's like, "No, fuck that. It won't work. You'll never this be redeemed." He's like, "Okay, I get to keep my no, helmet, though, right?" It. And then she's like. Yeah, I yeah, guess so. He's like, I had all my armor and the dark saber. And she's like, Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. Yeah, but on paper. On paper, you're not, you're not a mentor. <laughs> yeah. He's like, Can I still bounty hunt? It's like, Yes. Yeah. But it reminds me, does he still have that... the black, uh, black can... saber? The dark saber? Uh, he has the dark saber. Yeah. Okay. He got it Remember when he used it on the giant robot in Boba yeah. Fett? He was like, Pew, oh. pew. <laughs> like, Why didn't he even go there? Why didn't he just go to Mandalore and. In, oh, I don't know. Man. Surely he could do it pretty quickly, right? Because of the whole hyperdrive thing. Assuming that these trips don't take like multiple days or weeks, yeah. depending on the distance. I mean, Mandalore, he could have gone there by now, surely. Well, then again, I don't know how much time has passed. I can't believe he's in this stupid ship. I can't yeah. get over how yeah. dumb this Such ship is. Such a bad is idea. What the fuck is that? The marker! That uh, looks like the silhouette of like a Mandalorian flying. Mandalorian. Kind of. It's a little like oh, no, that's a, no, it's a that's giant. Oh, it's a monster. giant creature. All right, <laughs> space yeah. monster. Oh, look at them. There's four of them. Well, that's new. I guess. Well, maybe it's a Are Rebels thing or a Clone Wars thing. 
Are oh, there no. like whales that can travel? Comment section. Let us know. Um, wait, was he? Actually how did you get in there? Like, what? Hey, yeah. What? Uh, how did you? I guess what? the compartment attached together. There's like a tunnel. But there's I mean, a suit there would, that man why, yeah, in. I guess he must have custom installed it. Otherwise, why the hell would yeah. that be there? Well, that's horseshit. That's, that's, that's a horseshit. bad idea. <laughs> also, man, it seems like he's that. actually just sleeping in this position. Man, this would be so much yeah, comfier exactly. with, you know, a big like, shed. Yeah, 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 I know what you mean. Oh, yeah. back, to, back to this place. Navarro! Uh, Navarro. Yeah, that's uh, right, Navarro. Time to get our cameo. Yeah. Hooray. Oh, uh, I guess they're doing a big pan of this area to show how it's developed. Look, it's a little bit greener. See? They got some trees Ooh. and stuff. Don't care. Uh, well, because I was about <laughs> to complain about how we're wasting time with all these shots, but it's like, oh, I guess it's a little bit of world building. I'll give you that. Absolutely fine. Yeah, I have no complaints about these shots. Yeah, this is Yeah, because fine. nobody says anything. No, exactly. No one's <laughs> talking or shooting. All right, here we go. We got Mando walking through town. There you go. Yeah. of the outer or rim. Gonna, That's Look a at lie. him sitting in his little little cradle. Oh, look at him. Being look at how cute. adorable he is. Oh, he likes look. food too, remember? That's the thing. Yeah. That's right. food. Especially uh, now, see, now see, that robot is the guy I want to see the story of. This yeah. robot chef with six arms. Looks a little you know? I want to, yeah. Oh, Rogue, where's, where's, where's our, where's our Rogue 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 here, right? There he is. Yeah, that I are. Uh, rats on the crumb. trees! Tree rats! A lot has changed around here. Shut the fuck yeah, up. Why the robots you are see that? changed around here. I they can see that white with my eyes. Now. I, was, I was about to say, it's funny how Friggy went to all those lengths to explain the, the subtle wow. illusion of showing us things have changed, and then Matt was just like, things have changed oh, around here. They built a statue to this fucking robot. How come he gets yeah, a I mean, statue? Shouldn't he... everyone get a statue? Well, yeah. Remember old man in the desert? Where's his statue? Yeah, what the fuck? Yeah. No, he <laughs> didn't get a statue. Yeah, where, where is his statue? But to be honest with you, like my Mando should get a statue Asian. too. Like, a every... robot? Yeah, everyone liberated He's this place. He's got a little robot holding his, his cape. Yeah. Look at <laughs> that. Kind of funny. What is my life? You carry capes. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> he, th this needs the Flintstones moment oh, where they look at the camera and say, Yeah, it's a living. <laughs> yep. How do they get up the stairs? Show me, you cowards! Go back! They Show little, me how they get up those right, stairs, you they, look, they shoot cowards. Up, they go, the belters are mining the asteroid fields at the edge of the system. You did that really quick. Hmm. Yeah, in like, what, a couple of years, well, basically. Who knows, maybe 20 years have passed. <laughs> who fucking knows? You're still running around here with the... Same little crew. Using the force for that? Yeah, he's that like pushing against the table, I guess. That's the most content you'll get out of the episode, probably. I removed my helmet, and now I'm an apostate. I removed my helmet, now I'm an apostate, which I love the he, grief would just be like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? That's what? dumb. High magistrate of pirates in the courtyard. Pirates in the courtyard. Yeah, I mean, why not? Man what if it's here, like a, so... a ship with sails that's just sitting in the courtyard? I just, I just, I'm just glad that these people arrived right when Mando Oh, did. it's the bad people. On, Look, it's the people who are bad. That'll be enough of that. Enough of that vein. Do they don't have police? You have to go to the high magistrate? You don't have police? That's like whenever someone's getting robbed, you go to the mayor's office and you personally get the mayor to come here. <laughs> and then he does come here. <laughs> Personally. This is a school. You're cut of my boss's treasure that built this saloon. Yeah, so it's my cut. So, hmm. what's the issue? It's it's my cut. Join me for a drink back at my office. We drink here. At the school? Maybe Why would you want to drink at a school? Are you just evil? <laughs> Are you just evil? Oh, There's because not a it's... bar inside. There's no alcohol inside. But Rags, it's a <laughs> pride not? thing, you see, because it was a bar when he was last here. We built another bar. And I was going to really say, just nice. go to the other fucking Over there. bar. What's wrong with you? Is it... We actually gonna have a fight because you just you want to drink in a yeah. school. I mean, the and alien looks good, I guess. Scene. I like the variety in the aliens. Obviously, yeah. this, yeah. this yeah. if it hasn't been mentioned, this clearly has the highest budget and care out of all the shitty Star Wars shows outside of Andor, of course. Yeah. I'm never talking about Andor if I say anything like that. Okay. Sounds like you went soft. What are we doing? Go on, here? just shoot them all. Go. Beep, 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 yeah. beep. Oh my gosh! I carry around a gun. <laughs> on Don't go. miss and hit anyone behind you. Yeah, it seems really dangerous to just do this here. Look, yeah, literally like people running, running around. around. Away, look at them. Oh, those very guys responsible, Mr. Yeah, High Magistrate. Are they going to laugh and hug? Oh, okay. Tell ah. Captain Billion Shark that Navarro is no longer friendly to pirates. As of now? It was friendly to pirates <laughs> it was before? friendly to pirates. <laughs> now they like wanted you? to drink at the school. Oh, there you go. too far. Pew, 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 pew. Now all you better dead. He just goes like, oh, you, you're not? You could have told I us guess before. I guess none of the men had time to shoot or anything. 
And I guess wow. that this guy's not very upset about all of his buddies getting killed. Well, no, pirates. We don't have to. So like obviously he's... he'll be back with yeah. more men. Yeah. Why would you do this? Sure, you want to let him go? He'll let it be known that Navarro is respectable now. Ah, oh, yes, not to be trifled with. They're not just gonna. You you literally only did this because Mando happens to be visiting. Well, yeah. if he wasn't here, you'd be uh, dead. Man, it's the same with the Mandalorians. They would have been eaten by that crocodile if Mando hadn't shown up at just the right <laughs> dude, moment. Dude, plenty of them were eaten like by the crocodile. Cro dude, that is oh, that Marshall is worth Dune? empathizing. Yeah. I need a marshal. What about Marshal Dune? After she brought in Moff Gideon. She was recruited by special forces. She was recruited. Oh, you say. mean she was fired by Disney or recruited by special forces? <laughs> the last thing we intend is to bow down to yet another far off bureaucracy. Under my watch, Navarro will be. Yeah, but Navarro is a planet, not just this one city. Well, that's. But this is the Star Wars this problem the Star that they always Wars have. Yeah. yeah. They say go to a planet and you land on the planet exactly where you need to, as if a planet is just a No one goes anywhere just, else. It's, yeah, it's the one little mini map. It's just this conversation is making me think about how much we've delved into the bureaucracy and Andor and all of the like, yep. you know, contractors and all of the different divisions of, of the Empire and how they manage these Wait, sectors what? and cities and, and, you know, parts of the Empire. I can't serve as your marshal. I have something pressing to attend to. What can we provide? I need him back. Clearly not. You... With me. Wait, he's going to try and bring him back? Yeah. No, just get a new unit. Buy yeah, one from the company. Funny. The company makes and sells things. He needs a droid. Oh my oh, god. Fuck off. Why? You... you don't know people? What? And uh, Mando spent his life bounty hunting, right? He doesn't have connections. I he doesn't you. have friends and contacts. You know what droids are? I, you know what? I think the reason why they're doing this is so that they can have a kind of chrome, sort of rusty looking version of, of the. Yeah, see. Where are you going to put they're the gonna... droid, though? You only have the small ship. Merchandise. Yeah, that's right. Where will you put him? Yeah. But this is why they're doing it, because he can be like a gold version did... that they can sell as a toy. This is a skill he has, I guess. So desperately want it. If you so desperately want his brain, just put it in a different droid. This I'm yeah. assuming that's possible, yes. Yeah, specifically an IG unit. Why are you doing this? Merchandise. Oh, I'm asking in universe for you know? Yeah. <laughs> He's doing it for merchandise. He's hooked up to power. Let's see if we can wake him up. I can't believe that there's like still the robot and say he got exploded to bits. How is he possible? Yeah, I, I, I and fell into the lava. Remember? I thought he went into the lava, but whatever. Yeah, Som the somehow IG11 has returned. I just like that they left this data just in there in the statue as well. Oh yeah, does anyone wouldn't... care about the fact you just defaced the statue hardcore? <laughs> Yeah, remember how you mentioned you needed this guy for trust? Good job, Mando. <laughs> How'd you miss all those shots? Oh, wow. Just shoot him. Dirt. Shoot his head. Shoot his head. That's how you kill him. You oh shoot his head. Oh, my God, Mando. Shoot his what head. What are you doing? What? <laughs> what are you no, doing? That's a hot, that is a literal hot potato, man. Shoot, shoot his head. Is... Shoot his oh head. You know God. how to... Oh. Okay. Also, People big, big tip. Good. When there's a crawly robot trying to kill you, just leave the fucking room. I think he defaulted to his old programming. You think? You think? Oh, you think? You think? Now we're down a statue and a robot. We're, we're already down a robot. I guess we're just down well, a think, statue. And you look like an incompetent loser. Him. He still wants to fix him, I guess. I can't. Uh, I, I, I just, and a new one! I don't get it, man. Go to the store and purchase one with money. You would think this is where they put Boba in, right? It's like, oh, I need someone I can yeah. trust. Yeah, that's it's actually like, a really great oh, point. Why wouldn't he ask look, Boba? Look who it like, is. He's so uh, fucking insistent that it's this robot. What, what does he think robots are? I don't know. He's a very strange man. Uh, I've hated all droids. Guys. I would rather see the sitcom of these guys repairing, you know, miscellaneous yeah, dealing with everyone yeah. Shit. In the galaxy, yeah. yeah. And they sing too, like Alvin and the Chipmunks. Okay. Uh, no, I don't need that. That's no good, I need this one. This one is my friend. Well, when you crushed his head, you probably did that. He says the memory circuit is shot. Well, put in a new one. But that well, would be the same person. Just get another one. Just get a new, <laughs> just get a new fucking draw. Oh, this is oh, beyond God. This is agony. He God. really, really wants this one robot. Yeah, buy a new droid. This one is Poodoo. Can you fix it without the memory circuit? Yes, but I do not think. What if I find you the part? Okay. What if we order one from like the internet? Yeah. Space Mazon or something. Why do you? What if care I so much grief? 
What if I oh. just... What if I go to the company's website and order a new part and use money to purchase it? Yeah. If Grogu truly wanted him there, he would have used the Force. So, our quest is now to get a stupid memory Hope part. This, this is definitely a side quest. What happened to- what happened to going to Man- Wait, 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 what happened to Mandalore? Us, we're doing that after we get the unit, so that we have a bodyguard or some shit. Yes, he needs that droid for that, apparently. Isn't it- Why doesn't he get one of the Mandalorians to go with him? Why would he- Why- He's tried with the- the group, right? I'm guessing? I don't know. He this saved the their lives, they that. could owe him one. Well, you'd think one of them would be like, fuck it, I'll come. <laughs> like, yeah, whatever. this guy, this well, guy saved even, our no, lives. Last, last time he wasn't a group, everyone died, so... We're like, honor bound to help him because he saved our lives from the crocodile. Let's go to Mandalore and check it out. Because that's probably useful information for us to know anyway. And plus, if he's an apostate and he's going, we should have one of our own watch. Yeah. You know? And this... Hang on, kid, we got pirates. Oh! For real. You can't just sneak away after cutting down four of my brothers and- Oh, he is upset about it, okay. Uh, yeah, that's pretty Well, he's expected, fucked here, right? But... If they just start shooting at him, right? Well, they're right next to an asteroid field, so we're gonna be going yeah. through that. It's gonna be a great action scene, I'm sure. Man, we got big monster fight, blaster fight, and space fight. They did the- Do you remember got when it all. flying through an asteroid field was, like, really dangerous? No, it's what you normally do now. Uh, da, 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 this isn't a da, thing da, that like Han Solo did out of desperation being a talented pilot. This is just what everyone does. All right, when's when's one of the pirates going to crash into an asteroid? Soon. Why did you make the they, noise again? They, they, I was about to ask. They probably algorithmically figure out how long, how many times they can play it per episode and when. Oh, there's like six of them now. Jeez, one, two, three, yeah. four, Boom. five. Y'all suck. Has anyone got eyes on the Mandalorian? Well, let's use yeah. our radar scanners. I guess we're fucked. He's gonna surprise attack us. I just... Oh, there it is! Again. Again. <laughs> yeah! God, how is he so good at everything? He's yeah, really good at found it. again! He's an amazing shot, an excellent pilot. He can repair droids. He can, like, do anything. Do God, it again. He, and he's a great sword fighter. They did it again! They did it again! Oh shit, okay. like, that's like buildings and stuff. Are they okay? Yeah, they're... Uh, it's fine, don't worry about it. Bring the Mandalorian to you, Captain. Captain? And who is the Captain? Who are they? Are they a recognizable, iconic character? Oh, that's a cool ship. Yeah, I like yeah. the ship. Oh, you're oh, dead. Commando's fucked now. There's just, yeah, you're like... dead. Dang, Ferric. They have a target lock on us. Dang. I don't <laughs> care how bad he smells, you have to... <laughs> <laughs> Oh, he does look dank. Oh, oh look boy. at him. <laughs> he dank. I have no quarrel with you, Guardian Shard. Shard. We have Shard. Shard. A Shard. tree frog, as in a frog who is also a tree. It's actually cool to just look at him. Because it's yeah, not he is an CG. Guy. And, and I, I say that as if they've had only CG or something in this episode. They haven't. It's they just did it again. The... Oh, and he's just, there we go. He got away with hyperspace. Okay. Oh, he got oh, away well. because all the guns be... missed him. That guy's going to be a minor villain throughout the season. Yeah. This is Kalevala. It's another planet in the Mandalorian system. I don't care, Mando. Just that land. Maybe he's not going to remember anything you're saying right now anyway. Mandalorian castle? It's a Mandalorian a castle. Thing? It's probably really shit. Oh, this will be bo then. Probably. It's a cool robot. Oh, that's a droid. Man. Get that one. Damn, two cameo. I think everything we said about the formula has, has been in this episode. We've had several said, action scenes, actually. To be yeah. fair, I said two to three, and that's exactly what we got. Because the first and one we just had are definitely action scenes. The weird standoff one, that was like half an action scene. Kind we literally got one. two to yeah. three scenes of action. Yeah. And they yep. never show them yeah. getting in and out of that ship. They never will. <laughs> they <laughs> never <laughs> will. Hi, I'm such and such. Welcome to such. Okay. Okay, fine. <laughs> just no, walk in, I guess. So you're really busy. Yeah. You just sit <laughs> here, just sit in this chair. Just sitting, yeah, you just sit here all day, every day. Bo Katan, I'm here to join you. When I returned without the dark saber, my forces melted away. I'm sorry? Melted you, away? All of them died because you didn't have the because dark you don't saber. Have a sword. The fucking glowy I, sword. I, that's that's what. No way. Uh, I guess the saying left, like yeah. abandoned her. You lead them. Wave that thing around. 
and they'll do whatever you say. They uh, really so just give a shit about whoever carries the sword. Wave the thing the around. Also, he offered it to her, the little stupid... <laughs> like, and she's like, no. Uh. Like, I defeat you. Well, and then it's like, well, yeah, well, which of us has the stupid rules again? And also, like, it's pretty lame that it's like, well, you've got the sword, so we'll follow you. And it's like, what if they're a bad leader? This reminded me of all the questions we had. What if you have a heart attack? Who gets the sword then? Remember, she's like pissed at him because he beat the guy with the dark saber. That's why. What was his really... choice? Yeah, like he died. <laughs> if only he died. Do. Man, so her life sucks. Then everyone abandoned her. I am going to Mandalore so that I may bathe in the living waters. They're beneath the civic center in the city of Sundari. I wonder what a Mandalorian civic Thank center you. is like. Okay. By the way, do we have like a droid and memory pack or something? The planet is really poisoned. We're gonna have to have an IG unit lying around. Can just go and check. Can you just give her a call or something? You went like all the in way the real world. This. We've sent she'll, probes she, dude, like she'll the have surface a surprise, of Venus. She'll surprise him later in the season. She'll arrive in the oh, nick of time in some yeah. action day, scene yeah. or whatever. We did it. Oh, that's it. All right. Yeah, well, it's exactly, I'm gonna go pee. Yeah, it's just the same. Time. That, that is, yeah, that's yeah. everything you'd expect it to be. It's exactly what, we haven't we haven't skipped a beat. Amazing. No. Don uh, Favreau and Dave Filoni. Yeah, good job. I hope you're getting paid Kennedy. well for this. This <laughs> sucks. The, this, so, by the way, is the cracked formula. This is probably the best thing they've got going for him because people love this. This is the algorithm that, that Kevin Feige bot was talking about in She-Hulk. The thing is, She-Hulk, I can't imagine doing anywhere near as good as this. I, it's like, why? And it's like, oh, I don't know. This this hits all those basic a, like satisfaction like, levels for the average audience member, I think. The Maybe, Mandalorian yeah. has all of the appearances of something that should be good, but it's it's just not. It's got your action, it's got your mystery, it's got your comedy, it's got your cute factor, like it's got all of the things. And the fact that you can just jump between different places in the Star Wars universe, jump to new stuff and jump to old stuff. And there's a format for television, right, of like each episode is like some new adventure that ties into a grander narrative. Like it has all of the things that it needs to be really cool. But it's just like the writing sucks. Also, everything he just did, he could have just all did that, just giving them a call. It's like, hey, do you still have that droid? Yeah, it's broken. You can try to fix it. Well, Give it seemed her a like call he came up with the idea after seeing it in the plaza. He was just like, you know what? I like this droid. Now I want <laughs> okay. it. It's like, oh. And then I love how Grief Cog is just like, well, you can't. Then he's like, yeah, I can. I could just take parts off it and then rewire it, and then that'll just work. And he's like, okay. And then it does. And then it's a crazy robot that tries to kill them. I just want to oh. remind you, I, I, when I was watching that action scene, right? He's like, Grief, you know, catch Baby Yoda. And it's like, what the fuck are you doing? It's it's killing the person who holds it. That's the whole yeah. idea. It reminds me of the, like um, the Naboo Starfighter thing, where this character, against all logic and reason, needs to do things so that we can have callbacks and references. Yep. Mm -hmm. Even though, like, the, the Naboo Starfighter makes no sense at all for him to have at all. But it's a reference to remember the prequels, so we're going to have it. Yeah. I need a companion, so I'm going to, against all reason, try and reprogram this one robot that exploded, but I guess didn't explode or fall in the lava so that it can be a bodyguard with me instead of anything, any of the other options I have. That's mm -hmm. the only reason why they even showed the flashback of that robot in the beginning. It's like, here, remember this thing? Oh, it's yeah, yeah, because I remember saying, like, why are they showing <laughs> us this? I hope they involve scenes that aren't even in this fucking show, <laughs> because otherwise <laughs> people are going to know what's going on. Wait, sorry, why are they showing us this? Dude, that's so funny, because that, that okay. as you said, as you pointed out in that flashback, he just fucking obliterates, like, there's, there's nothing. <laughs> yeah. And it's like, no, don't you Whoa. worry, there's plenty of him left. <laughs> You're like, what? His entire well, top half is just fine. This, this is where the bomb is. Yeah. It's it's right just... in the middle. It's completely fine. <laughs> well, the question, of course, I mean, would be why is it the lower half of him is blown to smithereens, but the top half is not? Is he made of yeah. stronger yeah. stuff on the top half? Like, what? Yeah, the top half is the epicenter of the explosion. And I thought, I if, remember, you, if you remember in the episode, shot, the head kills him. you have to dig for this. Pretty sure that's supposed to be a detonation to prevent, like anyone from accessing him as a droid or something, right? Don't they have to, because it's it's set up earlier on. He goes to do it and like, they have to tell him not to or some shit. My designs are compromised. I must self-destruct. I'm not permitted to be captured. I must be destroyed. Man, it would be really awkward if that was the case. And then they were just like, yeah, but merchandise. <laughs> yeah, but fuck yeah. you. <laughs> then have these shitty writing decisions where you, they do the whole thing where they show the city. It's like, oh, this is all nice and changed. And then Mandu goes like, a lot of changed. They don't trust idiots you in the it. back who didn't understand what's going on, I guess. They don't trust you to infer Not anything. A, 
Not a bit. And so, yeah, they can't, they can't give you that much responsibility, Mel. Come and on. the reality, and it's pretty funny when, like, none of this is that complicated. Like, it's all very no. straightforward. And I was sort of floored as we were watching. It's like, oh, yeah, that's what Mando is. We, you know, like, an episode is, like, 30 minutes, and it feels like we achieve what could have been done in 10 because of how much time, like, how long it takes to achieve anything in this yeah. show. It's so thin in terms of the writing. Like, I, I never feel like I'm getting much out of any given scene. No. No, nope, yeah. It's like the scene is five minutes long and it could best be summed up as I need this, I don't have it, where can I get it? Go there. Okay. It's like, yeah. does it advance any character? It's like, nah, not really, because there aren't really any characters in this show. Okay. And, and Grief Carga, like yeah. it's Carl yeah. Weathers. That's why he was ever put in this in the first place. It's like, isn't it cool that Carl Weathers is here? And it's like, yeah, that is cool. Pretty much. Season two it's was me. like, it's yeah. Grief Weathers character you like, right, guys? And you're sort of sitting there like, I don't Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 and then he turns up in season three, and you're like, ah, Grief Kaga, gosh, we yeah. have such a long history, buddy, and you're like, name yeah. me one thing they did together, and you're like, well, they, the, they've shot that stuff together, I know that. I guess they, they're trying to imply that they just welded the fucker together again. Mel, well, somehow, IG-11 returned, that's all you need. Yeah, yeah. Um, can I just say thank you to the person who fucking designed anything about this episode, putting that scene at the beginning with the giant monster fight thank you for letting us know that you know we're in for exactly what we were expecting straight away yeah one of the most Thanks embarrassing fucking oh, displays from the mandalorians i've ever seen let's yeah. grapple him and then he naturally <laughs> it's everything about it man the first thought i had is everyone get in the cave it can't get us and then we could shoot it from a distance with our guns yeah or know. just then. leaves you know and then it's like second it's thought really fly it can't get you yeah. if you fly it Continues to annoy me how they have just like animals out and about who are blaster proof. Because yeah. when you think about what a blaster does to like metal and stuff, yeah. and it just yeah. melts through it, and it's this hyper. It's like how the fuck are all of these creatures just immune to blasters? I'll buy. Yeah. Like, what are they um, made out of? A shell the same of some scene. kind of alien creature being able to like deflect or even tank it. But yeah, when you when you shoot inside their mouth several times, I'm just like, okay, fine, I guess. This whatever. Just, yeah, this is like mm. those shitty '50s movies where it's oh, it's a big ant, but our tanks are ineffective. <laughs> <I'm> like, oh, <laughs> okay. Or yeah. the fact that as you put it out, like oh, blasters aren't working. Let me try my grapple. Like, <laughs> well, the grappling yeah, and that claws did work. were able to, and then it actually sticks in. Yeah, you're yeah. right. What a shitty fight that's only meant to make people go, whoa, the man. And Lawrence okay. are shooting their guns against a giant oh, crocomon. So Multiple cool. are dying. Woo! That's so cool. It was really bad, but I yeah. can't see this trick in our audience. We should be fine. <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> EFAP chat, how you feeling? I think this was shit, but I, I wonder if that's going to be controversial. I'm assuming not this time around. It's, I know it's uh, better than Boba uh, Fett and Kenobi, at least in production value, but holy fuck the writing. I yeah. love that she ran it with her fucking tools, man. What was that? <laughs> like, yeah, it's fucking pointless. Mandalorians are great, guys. You dumbass. Cool, you and you're right to think that they're cool. Also, I guess they, they, they just assume you've watched Boba Fett because the only thing they say is like, oh yeah, Grogu, you came back to me. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> like, oh, I want to say yes, but like that opening conversation Mando has with Smith Lady felt like 70% of it we'd heard in Boba Fett. Yeah. It felt pointless. Yeah. I still don't know why he wants to be a Mandalorian again. I, I have know. no idea what Especially investment or connection honestly, he has. Honestly, Rags, I him. think they think that they did all of that in the previous seasons. Uh, oh, yeah, I'm sure that, yeah. Like, that's all done. We know we know all that stuff. And it's like his parents were killed and he was rescued by Mandalorians. That's why. It's mm -hmm. like, that is... You think that's sufficient? Okay. Even though he should be the leader right now because he has a dark saber, but that's fine. Don't no, leader, that's a different thing. These, remember, these are spooky, weird cult. The dark saber people are a different spooky, weird Mandalorian cult. They're all weird cults. They suck. Wish there was at least one respectable cult out here. <laughs> like, just, yeah. just one, come on. With, and with just wipe one. the floor of every other Mandalorian because they're actually cool. Yeah, off to a great fucking start. Yeah. Incredible we, work. It's like I we never seven, left. Nothing less. Seven left, ladies and gentlemen. Huh. Thanks for watching, folks. That was Mandalorian hey, Season 3, Episode yeah. 1. See you next time. Yeah. Yep. Bye, Good everybody. stuff. Bye, everyone. Uh, uh. What'd you bring me?